Diary of Ferguson, September 10, 2014. In response to the police with their tear gas, yes, yes, no, no, no. Only I was just trying to sate the anger of summer with rain. In response to the question, did Brown really start the whole commotion? Basically, I stayed home all night without work. Who else is working nowadays after they shut down the factories at this Midwest town? Still waiting for the turnaround for the recession. Jobs are coming, they say. Jobs are wilting like grass. I waited and waited, armed with prayers. At least I will get a runaway bullet from the panicky police who are blessed with new work and salaries to keep this town from blocks and more impatient protesters. I've been watching television all day long and forced to spend the last remaining months after they, after they laid me off in this broken annex with my cousins, father, mother, sisters, and another, another couple, their son and their dogs. Nobody cares. After all the smoke and commotion and shooting, my, cop, my wife keeps a video diary to chronicle, to chronicle our hopes and dreams and post them on YouTube, hoping for some people at least to know we are still barely surviving, but we cannot breathe barely. Thank you.